afternoon, LHS. Welcome back to another edition of Blue Devil News. I'm Olivia. And I'm Chance. For all of our bibliophiles, aka book lovers, today is World Read Aloud Day. Head down to the library and check out all of the new reads for February. World Read Aloud Day is a great way to engage teachers and students in reading and support school-wide literacy. Studies show that reading aloud benefits all students, even high schoolers. The LHS Spring Blood Drive will be Friday, March 2nd, and we are now taking sign-ups. Donors must be at least 17, weigh 110 pounds, have no tattoos in the last six months, and be in good health the day of the drive. The goal for this semester is 125 pints. All donors must show proof of who they are at time of donation. Any person who donated last year will be given the priority for time. Teachers, you may email Kelly Harper the name of students who wish to donate. The blood drive list will be available from 7.30 to 1.30 and be available during lunch. Teachers, please emphasize the importance of blood donation. Over 800 pints of blood are needed each day to support the needs of Middle Tennessee and Southern Kentucky. Let's show Red Cross the true giving spirit of Lebanon High. Here at Lebanon, we have plenty of school spirit. Let's watch our seniors perform their winning dance routine at the pep rally last Friday. I'm so proud of our 2018 class. They worked hard to make that dance amazing, and it paid off. Now let's see some course promos for underclassmen interested in broadening their schedules. Make sure you're paying attention to all of the wonderful classes Lebanon High has to offer. Um, I would take this class because I want to be a veterinarian when I get older, and I've always loved animals. I started taking this class whenever I took ag science and small animal science and I really like the class and the teachers are really fun. My name is Autumn and I highly recommend taking large animal. Ms. Turner is a great example on how to do things with livestock like cows and pigs and like the bigger animals. If you're interested in that, she makes it in a more fun way um, and you just, it's easier to learn with her and I just highly recommend take large animal y'all. I'm Ms. Randall, and I'm going to talk a little bit about health science and medical therapeutics. First, I want to start with health science. Health science is um, an introductory course to our program. Usually, it's really good for freshmen and sophomores to take this class. However, it is offered for anyone that is available that want to learn about health sciences. Uh, but building in the career uh, of medicine, it's really good for, to start out with this course. It gives them a good, strong foundation for the other upper class or upper division classes that we also teach. I also teach another one, it's medical therapeutics. It's more based on a, a building block of health science, so you learn more um, advanced material uh, in a different aspect of health science. Medical therapeutics is a course you guys should take because it teaches you about the different medical fields, and not only that, it's also more of the therapeutic side, like art, dance, massage therapy. So just make sure you guys join this class. Culinary arts. I can't say enough good things about it. We have 
four programs, one, two, three, and four. Um, there's great camaraderie when you take culinary because you're in the class four years, so you get to know the kids that are taking it and the instructors very well. Um, we like the fact that we do a lot of extra things like Iron Chef, we do Pro Start, we do skills competitions. We work on getting our kids to compete in areas so that they can win scholarships. Plus we have a good time and you get to eat. When the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie, that's amore. When the world seems to shine like you've had too much wine, that's amore. Bells will ring, tingle-ling-a-ling, tingle-ling-a-ling, and you'll sing. Class, uh, for anybody interested in business, uh, it's something that encompasses the entire business world. Uh, it's the language of business, so not our, only are foreign languages offered here at Lebanon, but we also have the language of business, which is accounting. Uh, so if you're interested in having a future in business or starting your own business in the future and you would like to see how um, accounting records are kept, uh, financials are kept up for a business, and how the business is ran as a whole, uh, accounting is the class for you. Uh, so please sign up for accounting. I uh, look forward to seeing you next semester. All right, I took this class because I'm really bad at managing money. I figured it would make it better, and it hasn't yet, so I have my fingers crossed. Yeah, you can also learn how the banking system works, and you learn how to manage your money properly. I'm taking accounting because I want to know how businesses are ran, and I'm also going to go to college to learn about more about accounting. So uh, I took accounting because this is what I want to do as a career when I get older. The crew meeting for the musical is tomorrow right after school in Miss Sweet's room, A702. LHS will be starting a technical theater class next year, and if anyone has tools they would like to donate, that would be greatly appreciated. If you see a freshman basketball player in the halls, make sure to congratulate them on their win Monday night against Station Camp. Our Blue Devils won 60-53, which makes them 10-5 on the season. They will play tonight at Gallatin in the last regular season game, and the freshman district tournament will start on Saturday. Basketball Senior Night will be tomorrow at home against Gallatin. Boys will be honored at halftime of the girls game, and girls will be honored at halftime of the boys game. Girls tip off at 6.30 and the boys to follow. This will be the last home game of the regular season, so make sure to support your Blue Devils. Seniors, please pay your $60 senior fee to the bank or online. $20 AP test deposits are due to Miss Boyd, your AP teacher, or online. Attention all Science Olympiad members. Your last day to pick out your competition event and turn in your fee is this Friday. Please see Ms. Otis in room 105. All Beta Club field trip forms are due to Ms. Carpenter today at 2.20. Make sure you stop by the bank to get hoodies and crewnecks. Freshman shirts are also on sale. There will be a senior lock-in February 9th from 7 p.m. to 8 a.m. There will be movies, food, and dodgeball. Tickets are on sale for $5 at the bank. The Latin Club interest meeting in room B211 with Mr. Judkins has been moved to after school on Monday. Students who can't make it can stop by B211 at any time. Senior night rehearsal will be Friday at 2.30. Performers should be prepared to perform. Any students who are interested in helping produce senior night should also attend. There will be a, re a recount election today for one senior superlative category. Seniors, be sure to vote outside A303. Juniors and seniors, join us for a night at Gatsby's, Friday, April 6th at the Wilson County Expo Center. Prom tickets will be on sale at the Blue Devil Bank and online. Junior tickets are $55 and seniors $45. National FFA Week is February 19th through the 23rd. FFA members, be sure to check with an officer, advisor, or social media for details about daily activities. Any FFA member interested in dairy judging, livestock judging, or milk quality and products needs to see an advisor ASAP. Practices have just started. That's it for today, Blue Devils. I'm Olivia. And I'm Chance. This has been news to you from the White and Blue. Have a great day, Alicia.